bunny and kangaroo friends. It's Brenda here. I hope you are staying cool and drinking lots of water in this hot weather. Tookie is um, going to show you how to make sun tea in one of the videos. And her sun tea and talking about the sun made me think about the moon. The sun comes out at, in, um, during the day. The moon comes out at night. And I have a book. It's called Good Night Moon, Good Night Moon by Margaret Wise Brown. If you have this book at um, home, go grab it and read along with me. But instead of reading all the words in the book, I thought I'd use the felt board to tell the story. And it start, starts with, in the great green room, there was, a telephone, right over there, a very old telephone, and a red balloon. There was a picture of a cow jumping over the moon and three little bears sitting on chairs. There were two little kittens one, two, and a pair of mittens right over there, hanging on, looks like a clothesline. There was a little toy house and a little very young mouse. I'm gonna put the mouse with the kittens. There was a comb and a brush, and a bowl full of mush, or oatmeal. And there was a little old bunny whispering, hush, I think in the book it says a little old lady, whispering, hush. And we can say, good night, moon. And, or good night, room, and good night, moon. And good night to the cow jumping over the moon. And good night, light. And good night to the red balloon. I'm going to put the book up here so you can see it. And good night, bears. And good night, chairs. And good night, kittens. And good night, mittens. Where are they? Right there. Good night, clocks. There's a clock over here to tell time, and there's a clock right on top of the fireplace. And good night, socks. Next to the mittens. Good night, house. And good night to the little mouse. Good night, comb, and good night, brush. Oh, on this page it says good night, nobody, and good night, mush. Well, remember, oatmeal maybe. And good night to the old bunny whispering hush. Good night to the stars, and good night to the air. And good night noises everywhere. The end of the book. I was thinking that after this story, I'm going to put my board right over here, and I'm going to get my lap desk. And I thought maybe we can make a picture with a moon and some stars. So if you look in the bag, in the box that teachers brought to the house, and if you find maybe a black piece of paper or a very dark blue piece of paper, grab it and we'll use it as our sky. And if you have a bag, 
that has some um, tissue paper in it. I see white tissue paper and yellow tissue paper. This one also has green and purple. But I think I'm, I am going to pick out a yellow piece of paper and a white piece of paper. And we can make our own sky picture, our night sky picture. Now, if you have some glue, there, there should be glue in the box you can grab. And I don't know if there would have scissors, but if you have scissors at home, you could use scissors. And I'm gonna cut a little bit of the white paper. sort of made a moon but if you don't have scissors that's okay because you could also I think I'm gonna grab another white piece of paper you can use your fingers and tear the paper I have two moons one two Take your glue and put it on your paper. And stick your moons on. I think I'm gonna use my fingers. You could use your fingers. You could use the scissors. And you can make stars. I'm going to put glue on my paper and stick it on. Usually there's actually only one moon in the sky, but I put two on my paper. You can make your night sky look any way you want. Another way you, what you could do to make stars is you can, oh, it's, my fingers are getting sticky. You can tear the paper and you can roll it and scrunch it up into your in your fingers like a ball and put some glue on and you can make a star that sort of looks puffy two-dimensional and you can make your um, sky picture any way you want the stars kind of remind me of a song about twinkle twinkle little star how I wonder where you are, up above the world so high, like a diamond in the sky. Bunny and kangaroo friends, that's the end of my st story. And if you make your um, a um, star and moon picture and you want to show teachers, feel free to have mom um, or parents um, email it to us and we can see it. You guys take care and enjoy, and I'll see you next week. Bye.